Hey, all Pro Exterior Services here again. Uh, this is a house neighbor's been out talking to me quite a bit. He just recently had a heart attack. Thank God he went to the hospital. But anyway, this is one that we did a while back. I don't know if you remember. It's kind of one of our annuals. So, just he's having some services here this weekend and the Easter. Wanted to get his house cleaned up, so that's what we're gonna do. We got the AO45 today working in full bleach. I'm gonna go ahead and hit this wall right here right away because there's no property protection. So when I work these angles, as you can tell, it's kind of tight here. I'm gonna go ahead and turn my soap on. When I work these angles, I tend to hit this side from this angle. You see what I'm talking about? Like I can hit this side and I come back from that side and shoot this angle. I'm gonna go ahead and wet the fence down a little bit. So we'll get that wet. Okay. Wait on some Kim. And this is a shady side. Already hit the air conditioner. I'll get excited. So we're good. Wait on Kim. Wait on Kim. Getting close. I smell it. There you go. So we'll hit this side. Well, we got a little bit of wind. Let's move up a little bit. There you go. Hit the, hit the facial good, get a lot of sun, so. Yeah, we're just working it. Sorry you guys getting bleached on, but that's part of our life. And come over here, hit the hit the bottom part the section. We hit this wall here. Quite a few minutes. Not a big deal. And we'll come back and hit the other side. That way you don't get bleach all over you. Try to stay bleach free, baby. Alright guys, on the back side of the property, just doing some property protection. Got some fresh landscaping here, so we don't want to damage none of this. So we're gonna take the extra precaution to put some water down. Again, we're not using that hot of a mix to caution it, but something that we do. Take the extra precaution. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and soak some of this down a little bit, especially on the hot side. Get some of that soak. Soaking it up, look at it, it's soaking it up. It's so hot out here today. It's uh, 82 degrees. 82 degrees. We're gonna go ahead and spray this for him too. Uh, I'm just gonna post treat it. No surface cleaner, and it's brand new concrete. He just got a new shed built. Hey Tony, look, them hummingbird feeders, take them down. I'm gonna go ahead and do this too. Clean it up. Let's go with that extra step. You all right? What you do, man? those plants one more time before the soap comes out 
You just kind of wait for the soak. This is a customer, again, an annual customer. You know, we tend to set the schedule for the annuals, not the customer. And this customer wasn't due for about another month. But called and asked if I could do this for them to help them out because they have something going on here. So I'm just going to spray this down a little bit for them. Help them out. This is that extra step that I'm talking about. See? Like that. Just hit that real quick. You don't want to saturate it. Come up, little, little coat. this real quick. No problem with the AO. I gotta try to get underneath that little thing. Look at that. No problem. We got green, we got clean, baby. Just letting it soak, letting it work, letting it do its magic. We're almost done, this was his last sign. Strategically, we, we finished like we did. Try to get you in the shade. Looking out for my YouTube bitch, my, 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 uh, my viewers, look at that. Huh? Oh. Okay. Here, hit the whole front section real quick. Where to pre water our plants so don't get excited. Alright, watch out, Tony. Let me hit this front. Yeah, them gutters need painting. Yeah. So you get the back side of that column too. Get the door really good. this side. I'm gonna hit this side so I can hit the other side on the without getting drenched here. That's all right guys. We're good. We're golden. We go. No need to worry about all pro. We do this every day. The nice about the AR you can get that bad boy from where you stand. Praying it Kim. Alright. Turn the soap off. Looks like a rain cloud over there. Supposed to be no rain today. 
Sorry to wipe you guys off. Look at these windows again. Run that soap out, get that extra clean, get some windows. Any, any, uh, make sure you get all those columns really good, too. I can't stand that when you get a column and it's dirty. All right, guys. All we got to do is rinse here. And we'll be done. I'll go ahead and flush out my line. I may uh, soft wash this driveway for him. I don't know. They didn't call for that, so. All right, guys. We're going to go ahead and rinse it up. Catch up with your teeth. How we look on water? Okay. Got them windows are good. And then water down. And we're done. Do an inspection. Always do a walk around when you're done with the property. Before you pick up your hose. You never know if you're going to need it. Again, there's been times that we had to pull out uh, the hose again. And we learned over time. Just, hey, listen, don't pick it up. Let's just... Uh, Go do the property walk around right now. Make sure we're good before we go putting everything back and then have to drag it all out again. Plus, this is flushing out the gun too, and uh, not just the gun, but the uh, pump. Oh yeah, look at that. That was good. That was good too. Off your little trailer. Okay, guys, wrap it up. Catch up, peace. The house. Let's see what we got going on here. Got it hooked up. Uh, today on the uh, ratio, which did very well, we were right at uh, about three and a half on the SH, five on the soap, wide open on the water. Again, one inch, half inch, one inch. Uh, we got a one inch uh, feed tube. So you got a little. I sprayed this down. So, uh, but anyway, yeah. So it ran well at this mix and this setup very well. Uh, let me check the uh, SH. Well, 42 gallons. So we probably use, I don't know, eight, probably about 10 gallons, eight, 10 gallons, which is, that was a big house, nice spread. So all did well. In and out in about an hour on that last job. So we're wrapping up today. We had a customer switch some stuff around I tried to move some other customers around. It's tough, man. It's tough when you get people on, excuse me, lined up and, and you try to uh, reposition your schedule. It, it's You try to stick to a schedule and people got stuff that comes up and still charging them extra for that. All right, guys, please like, sub, call, comment, hit me up with any questions. Appreciate it. all the support for the channel. Peace.